looking at the different recipes. How they actually add white rum to Vera Mojitos. I don't think I do, at least not the ones I used to make out at my uh, ex-girlfriend Scary's house. Um, call her Scary because she uh, basically uh, give her alcohol and she becomes scary. There's a reason why her ex-boyfriend, who's an alcoholic, banned alcohol from the house, which I always found really strange because I knew him. He was wild. Showed a gun in the parking lot of Scarlet Oaks where I was driving through a few videos ago uh, to me. That was an insane. And I always wondered why would he ban alcohol? Oh, I found out. Uh, <laughs> scary. Uh, this is a mojito of cocktail set from World Market. We used to have them in Cincinnati, but the wonderful people of Cincinnati can't support anything, and then they boo-hoo, whine, and moan, but there is nothing. Oh, interesting enough, the same recipe thing I was just looking at, I have one from last time. Oh, this is a different version. This is actually from uh, 2007, when I was drinking the mojito. See, oh, they do it, they do it the way I like it, without the rum, where the new version has it with the rum, where I don't like that. Yeah, see, I got, mine's right. Okay. So, basically, see, if I had known that, I wouldn't even have to download this recipe. It never hurts to have it, just to be able to show it to people. I even got it written down. Ah, I love that. Now, this is really cool. It comes with the glass thing. The actual glass, nice old mojito on it. These are awesome. Um, never had a mojito party. I plan to one of these days. Uh, maybe this year with my surfer friends or something. Uh, of course, I have a video of it. Um, basically, uh, what do I got to do here? I'm going to uh, muddle, which is this. I'm going to take 15 uh, lime, not lime, fresh mint leaves or as fresh as possible. When it's in season, I just go in the backyard and get my uh, my fresh mint. I'm going to take simple syrup. Now, I just heated it up. It has to cool down, but I think it should be cooled down by now. Let me find a nice measuring cup because I need an ounce of this stuff. Oh, let's see. There's my measuring cup. I didn't quite think to have that one ready. Um, an ounce of simple syrup. It's still hot. It should be cooled down, but I feel like drinking a mojito before I go to sleep. Eh. It is almost 10 o'clock. I do work at noon, I think, tomorrow. Alright, the jungle. Then two days off. Pour that puppy in there. Then you grab a lime, I believe it is. Yep. Like this. I think I cut it up a little bit more. It says to use one whole lime. I really don't think you have to use a ton. It's been, like I said, I haven't made any of these since probably the end or the beginning of 2007. Um, okay, you muddle this first, which is basically you just kind of munch it down here. It's a little bat, you know, if the party goers get out of hand, you just, you know, <laughs> billy club them, I guess. <laughs> All of this, this great hat, this has been in my family forever, I mean, probably almost as long as I've been alive, uh, and it's my oldest brother, Bob's, who has a tendency to watch my videos, uh, uh, I took the hat band off it. It was supposed to be thrown away, but uh, uh, I love this hat. I was actually going to wear it in the last uh, Tattoo Billy music video, but that just didn't happen. Uh, you muddle this up. You don't have to do it as much as I do. Uh, let me check my time on this. Always try to keep it under 10 minutes. Oh, we got five and a half basically popping right now, so I'm going to do this. Um, I'm going to roll over here. It says, fill with crushed ice. Now, the nice part of this, I have an ice crusher over here. So I can basically, out of my girlfriend's in uh, uh, Milford, I had to basically uh, uh, had 
to basically um, uh, oh, I'm supposed to add the palma first. Okay, well, this doesn't always work out the first time. <laughs> Okay, now I'm supposed to how much? Oh, I'm supposed to have an ounce of this. I'm doing this completely wrong, I tell you, I know that. But, I, like I said, I've made them in two, since 2007. Actually, you're supposed to put the crushed ice in this glass. These, uh, And then, uh, oh, you fill this with club soda. Club soda, you need. Ooh, nothing like going to blow up. Um, basically, you do this. So you're not supposed to put the ice in there, from what I understand, if I can remember correctly. The recipe I got isn't the clearest thing. You do that, so you get this. Then you top this puppy with a uh, club soda. And uh, you can basically do them to your own taste. I used to do mine. Interestingly enough, I would actually sometimes substitute the club soda with um, a Sprite. And you'd get a, a sweeter mojito because these are sweet. That's why I like them. I like sweet uh, drinks. Some people, some tough guys, we call them foo foo drinks, blah blah blah. It's all alcohol, rocket science. Uh, I don't know. I like my drinks to taste good. You know, I don't want. I'm not a whiskey fan. Ugh. You know, who wants their stuff to uh, taste like something? I don't like. You lick the bottom of a shoe. I don't know. And I believe this is a mojito. I'm going to be taking me a sip here. Yeah, I remember why I use Sprite. It gives it a, a much sweeter taste than this. But this is actually nice. This would be a really nice drink uh, for a nice picnic party. I got my little portable picnic table that we will be using in uh, future videos. I hope to have a girl to be using it in romantic picnics with. Of course, have those on video. That would be fun. Um, oh, also discuss my my channel, the, the Amish Car channel. Uh, how technically it's kind of supposed to be used. Somebody actually used it the right way the other day. They watched one of my uploaded videos of the hawk by Kings Island. Compl you know, commented on that what type of hawk they thought it was. Probably is a red tail. And then they commented on or thanked me for putting a Testify, which is from Genetic, or Repo, the Genetic Opera, in my favorites, which is, you know, I put favorites there because it's kind of, that's almost like my radio station version on my YouTube channel, because it's, it's just songs I, I've been hearing, uh, like I heard War Pigs by Black Sabbath driving to work the other day as I was going by Scarred Oaks, I could actually pick up the radio station. Why it doesn't want to transfer that far, or transmit that far nowadays is beyond me. I guess maybe because they don't have a tower like they used to. I used to be able to get it all the way out almost to the nature center out in Milford. Now I can't even barely get it up the road uh, as I'm not even at Jungle Gyms, which is weird. Um, 